What's good, YouTube? Sitting there watching this, man. Connecticut Sun and Minnesota uh, Lakes. Beautiful game by Connecticut Sun, man. Like, <laughs> I ain't see this one coming, man. But this is what I've been telling y'all all year about the importance of, like, of playing defense. You know, defense, man, can take you such a, such a long way. And this here were, was two of the, you know, best defensive teams in the league. Matter of fact, all four games that – all four teams that played today were, you know, among the best defensive teams. Uh, but these two are the two best, and like the Connecticut Sun, if they can hold on, you know, we're talking about three minutes, 22 seconds left. Um, they up 86 73 up 13. By all accounts, they need to hold on. Um, as long as you're not turning the ball over, you're not taking too many early stupid shots and ending up with misses, they should they should win this. Um, man, great game, uh, by Bonner now, really big game by Bonner. Um, um, Alyssa Carrington, um, Mabry, you know, it was timely, you know, um, but, w but what they found something was with this Taisha Harris lineup, uh, this, they have a small lineup that is very effective right now. And it's, it allows them to have Mabry, uh, Carrington, Taisha Harris with Bonner and, um, and Alyssa Thomas out there. That lineup is very effective because they can run up and down the floor. Uh, one of the problems they were having with uh, Brianna Jones, who I do like, who gives you some tough minutes and, and stuff like that, though, is, you know, she's a little slow foot getting up and down the floor. This particular lineup, man, I don't know. That's this is going to make game five very interesting. Um, I still think, you know, Minnesota gets the advantage at home. But this lineup, man, is a little tough for that Minnesota, for that Minnesota defense. They are just so... Sound with these switches, man. It's amazing. And this beautiful game. 20 points for Harris. 16 for Bonner. 16 for Thomas. 13 for Carrington. Maybe 10. That's that's Sun Ball. Um, when they were at their best during the season. Because I think when I started watching this season, I identified them as my favorite team to watch early on. Um, when they got dusted by the Aces, they kind of killed my thunder a little bit. But... Um, yeah, Connecticut, man, they balling today. You know, they handling their business at the crib. Oh, Alyssa Thomas is just using that glass beautifully, man. She's just so strong and physical you know, the way she plays out there. It's crazy. Um, right now, our, it's Brianna, Brianna with the ball. And um, Courtney just drives on Carrington. Good sound defense as always, Carrington. Sound defense as always. Um, man. Yeah, man, you're proud of the sun. Because I, I was really afraid of Minnesota. I still am. Oh, man. Mabry and, <laughs> and Collier are getting mixed up. Collier don't she don't strike me as a fighter. I know Mabry got a little screw loose. But, um... What you call it? Um, Nafisa don't don't strike me as that, but she looks like she's really get it in, get a little test during the games, and that's what's up, man. And um, oh man, it looks like my Phillies want to hold on in the top of the ninth, six four over the Nets, mm, over the Mets, uh, Mets. I'm talking about Nets over the Mets. That's what's up, man. That's what's up. I was watching some of the Phillies a little earlier. Mm. Two minutes, 46 seconds left. Thomas bringing it up against Collier. See, I like about Collier. You throw on Thomas, you throw on some of the guards, whatever. But that Tyisha Harris, man, is really, she is like what the Aces needed. They just needed some um, unsung hero to come through with. That's what she was. She's unsung hero today on both ends, man. She out there d and up. I think uh, one of them just made a three now. It was that Smith? You got to pay attention now. It's a 10-point lead. It ain't over. It ain't over. Y'all need to, y'all got to continue to get buckets now, now, son. Minute 59, they keep playing, boy. Minnesota, you better be careful. Better be careful.
Thomas taking it up. Kicks it out to Harris. Oh, man, what a hell of a foul. Goodness gracious. Number two just playing hard, though. You know, just got out, out the air and probably tore. Bang that damn thigh up, it looks like. Time out, um, son. Courtney Williams brings it up against Carrington. Williams, nice shot. She is super nice ball in that mid range. Got Harris. Eight point game. Minute thirty six. You gotta run that clock, but y'all, y'all need to, you need, you need to get some scores. Need to get at least a bucket or two to kind of put this away. Risky pass there, Bonner. Bonner, mm, 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 mm. Bonner not playing today, man. She locked in. And that's what it is. That's the heart of a champion, you know. I think she's won a couple, if I'm not mistaken, with Seattle. Collier, oh, that shot over Bonner. Collier, man. All right, she's keeping pressure on. Minute 10 seconds. And they're not following. Well, I guess with eight minutes, ain't no point in following. You know, I will follow Alyssa Thomas, though. Alyssa Thomas shooting with one hand, so I'm following her. I'm sending out for the free throw line. We're going we're gonna to hack Alyssa. <laughs> That's what we're going to do. So Alyssa Thomas, one minute, one second left. Got to go to the free throw line. And um, you make these free throws, you put this game far, far away. You know, talking about an eight-point lead. A minute left. You got to make these. Oh no, it looks like this. Oh, okay, it's a side side out foul. Okay. A DJ pass it into Thomas. Thomas. With number 23 Garden. They go down to Carrington in the post. Ooh. Carrington with a nice little move in the post. She got like a lot of little stuff that she add to her game every every time I watch her, you know. Really, 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 really good player, man. I always feel Carrington get developed into that Paul George Kawhi Leonard type player and like, you know. Started to see with our offense. If she could just develop a consistent jumper, bro, I'm telling you. I don't know. She just had a good play of Courtney Williams right there. I think they're going to challenge that, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Another good game, though, man. Another good game. I know a lot of y'all thought uh, Minnesota was going to finish this out. You know, I don't know, man. I like the Sun, man, because I, I love I love defense. I love defense, man. I love physicality. I love all that stuff in basketball. Well, actually, I love it in any type of sports, any type of competition, you know. They showed Leah Boston and all the stuff she won on that TJ Maxx commercial. Shout out to Leah Boston. Got the TJ Maxx commercial going on. Good for her. Okay. Leah Boston got the Adidas. Okay, Leah. Go, Lee Lee. <laughs> oh, man. Aliyah, that's a really good name. It's a beautiful name. It means... um. It means like it means high and lofty, you know, Alia, you know, Aliyah. That's what it means. And that's good. It's the it's the uh, it's the female version of Ali. You know, you, you know the name of Ali, like Muhammad Ali, you know, stuff like that. Aliyah is the female version of that, you know. Really, really beautiful name. And the name Ali, if you add the definite article to it, the, or in Arabic, A-L-Al, then it means like, uh, it's a name of God, you know, because God is the most lofty, you know, he's the, the, the highest, you know, the most high, it means the most high. If you say Al-Ali, that means, you know, the most high. So we have 43 seconds left, 10 minutes to go. Connecticut versus Minnesota. 
This should be a rap for real, for real. They just challenged that. They let they let my girl DJ Nate get her block. Good, good, good game by them, man. I'm curious what to see what a lot of these teams are gonna do next year. You know, I hear um, DJ Nate Carrington is a uh, is a free agent. Um, some of the players, um, I think, on Minnesota like Beard, I think, or Alana Smith was that her name. Y'all got to forgive me with these names. I'm getting old, all right? And I'm used to men basketball, so. I like Brianna. Uh, I like the other one. I like her. Um, what's her name? Um, Kayla McBride. Yeah, I like her game a lot, man. They better keep her with Collier um, and as many of them other girls as they can. Definitely got to keep Williams. Because Williams is the truth. So I still think Minnesota probably wins, you know, the series. But I, but I like the fact that Suns, man, really going out like some, you know, like some real ones. I respect that. Forty-three point three seconds left in the game. Connecticut Sun up ten. Gotta go, I gotta take it back to uh, Minnesota and win it. Y'all gonna win it and then face the uh, the Liberty in the finals. Whichever team go, I would love to see them against the Liberty. I just kind of think, I don't know, from what I saw early in the year, the Liberty's just dust the sun. You know, Mabry can make a difference. I'm starting to see that. Mabry, Mabry's really a good player. You know, she's good. She has some off nights like anybody, but Mabry's good. Would have been really good, maybe hit that three, but yeah, this one is a wrap. Yeah, they just gonna dribble it out. Okay, sorry. So basically, good game, uh, hell of a win for the for the Connecticut Sun. Uh, so it looks like officially they're gonna win this by what ten, unless you know, yeah, if they're gonna dribble it out. It's a ten point win by the uh, Connecticut Sun. Good job by them. You know what I mean. I look forward to game five. Which would be what? Uh, Tuesday, I'm thinking, or Wednesday? And then after that, man, you, you know, you got the finals. See who get that rank. So whatever it is, we'll be crowned a new champion. So, shout out to the Connecticut Sun. That was a good one, man. I'll get with y'all peeps later. Peace out.